San Francisco is developing a number of programs specifically to increase the amount of affordable housing throughout the city. The Affordable Housing Bonus Program provides incentives for developers to include more housing for very low, low, moderate, and middle-income households. This program does not rely on public subsidies, but rather on private developers who will include this housing as part of their project. How will that work? First, some background. Under California's State Density Bonus Law, housing projects that include affordable housing on-site may request a density bonus. Generally, a density bonus is an increase in the number of housing units allowed under current zoning laws and is based on the amount of affordable units being provided. However, the state law does not address all of San Francisco's affordable housing needs and does not incentivize middle-income housing. So, the city is proposing an affordable housing bonus program to encourage higher levels of affordable housing development, including middle-income units, while providing a streamlined application, review, and approval process. So how does the program work? The program applies to key mixed-use and commercial corridors in San Francisco and offers incentives to developers who provide 30% affordable units in their projects. To reach 30%, 12% of the units must be permanently affordable to lower-income households and 18% must be permanently affordable to middle-income households. In exchange, developers will be able to build more residential units and up to an additional two stories beyond current zoning regulations. Buildings with 100% affordable units will be offered up to three additional stories beyond current regulations. Each building will be required to conform with design guidelines specific to the program, ensuring it meets with the character of its neighborhood areas and commercial corridors. This program is an opportunity to double the amount of affordable housing and directly address the goals established by the city's 2014 housing element and Proposition K, passed by San Francisco voters last year. Specifically, Prop K established a goal that 33% of all new housing built be permanently available to low and moderate incomes. This program will be the first to provide permanently affordable housing options that include middle-income households. To learn more about the program, visit our website at sf-planning.org slash ahbp.